Ah, yes, my favorite, the Nintendo logo. Can you please don't touch my mic? Brandon, stop. <sighs> <laughs> welcome one and all, and I don't know how that little welcome saying goes, but we're, we're doing, we're doing. So the, <laughs> welcome to the world's greatest show. Uh, Mario and Luigi Superstar Saga, as if I haven't already had enough of this game. We're doing it again. That's right. I'm doing Nerve Mode again, but this time with my brother. No, I'm kidding. I I'm not. No. <laughs> no. It's not happening. We Don't count on it. <laughs> okay. Alright, you, you want to go ahead and introduce the thing we're doing? Alright, so we are doing... Okay, so... No, I'm kidding. <laughs> we are doing a... I guess you'd say a Wheel of Fortune? Wheel of Misfortune. Type of thing uh yeah, but we're also a doing a really good name i'm gonna see whether or not that's already taken <laughs> we're also doing co-op the co-op wheel of misfortune yeah uh, so um making names on the go yeah okay so here's the thing so the co-op you're probably thinking no <laughs> <laughs> wait was i talking loud enough uh, I, I would assume so. I don't know. This mic's pretty good at picking stuff up. <laughs> I, mean, I, I was talking at, like, half the volume of you. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, anyways. So uh, you're probably thinking, no, it's Mario and Luigi. That's a single-player game. You can't exactly do co-op. Well, if I got news for you, you can do co-op with every version of Mario and Luigi Superstar Saga, except for every version of the remake. You, you can't do it with the remake, because, no. So, because the remake's big doo-doo. There, there's there's no there's no co-op there, there's no co-op option any that's right uh there's no co-op <laughs> option anywhere <laughs> there's no co-op option anywhere so how does that work well oh, I forgot how uh, these work. to boil it down you know just make it real nice and simple if you're playing the game boy advanced version of the game uh you, you can, can co-op like uh, okay yeah, that's, that's called a GameCube controller. um Not my you, when playing the game advanced version of the game you can do co-op and the way that works is that you've got basically you've got the game and your game boy advance but you, but, but you don't, because you, do you, you do the Game Boy Player thing. That's what, that's what the Game Boy Player logo was at the beginning. You do the Game Boy Player thing, you put it on the GameCube, attach the second controller, blah, blah. Similar for the Wii U, uh, which is what I'm playing on right now. If you do it on the Wii U, one person has the gamepad, then the other person has the Player 1 controller, <laughs> and there you go, co-op. <laughs> but that's not the actual challenge. It's part of the challenge, but that's not the actual challenge we're doing. The challenge we're doing is randomizing crap. I'm going to go ahead and... Please stop. I'm going to go ahead and just let the intro scene start playing while I explain this. So basically, it's a randomized Superstar Saga challenge. Um... <laughs> It's got, basically, there's a bunch, a bunch of different possible challenge rules that we can get with this challenge. And then there are also some absolute rules that we absolutely have to play with. Oh, hey, Brandon, I forgot about this. What? The one in bold. <laughs> or is that a permanent rule? But anyways, yes. No! <laughs> anyways, so, basic rules of the All challenge. Alright, mush overalls. The absolute rules. No. The, the rules of the right. challenge are basically... Well, not necessarily the rules, but the way the challenge works... I know, I'm doing a terrible job of explaining this. We have this wheel. Okay, let it laugh here. We have this wheel that has a bunch of different rules on it. And at the beginning of the game, as well as after every major boss fight, not including tutorials... We have to spin the wheel to get five of these rules. And if any rules conflict with each other, we have to re-spin to replace the most recent rule that is, you know, conflicting. Um, Real of additionally, when a game over occurs, the five rules that we already had are kept, but an extra rule is also added. Yeah, um, sorry, I forgot about this. Should I probably I be mashing through this. We're not gonna be reading stuff, by the way. I forgot, is Y or X my A? I I'm, think I'm it's controlling X. Toad real quick. Um, I think... Is it X, though? You know what? Fine, you can control Toad while I explain this. Um, I think that's it's it. It's my Y. I th yeah. Oh, wait, I've got one more note here saying, Furthermore, the wheel must be respawned if the rules end up forming a challenge that is impossible to beat. Also, there are some rules that are absolutely not optional. And the first one, which I have in bold, No Mush Badges! You cannot. M m no. Bad. 
No marsh badges. Uh, then there's marsh also overalls. no accessories or pins, which is the little third gear thought that you can put stuff in from Starbeans Cafe. Uh, and you must keep the work pants or work jeans, and as soon as possible, buy the castle badges. You cannot ever get rid of those, because there are some rules in here that have to do with all that crap. Alright, so... I'm sorry about this, but I'm gonna go ahead and pause it real quick with the virtual console menu. Yes. Alright, so, and no Starbeans Cafe drinks. That's it also a given. So, time to bring out the wheel, because we've already got our first fight of the game. Oh, shoot. Already? Yes. So, this is what the wheel looks like. As you can tell, it is a very beautiful wheel. No, not really. I, um, <laughs> I can't exactly just Google Chrome my way through this for some reason, so I had to use a display capture. But the possible rules that we can get... Hey, you're supposed to be slowly spinning. Why isn't it... Whatever. <laughs> the possible rules that we can get are HP only, BP only, power only, defense only, speed only, stash only, no HP items, no BP items, no items, no splash bros or bounce bros, no chopper bros or knockback bros, no fire bros or thunder bros, no swing bros or cyclone bros, no advanced bros attacks, no bros attacks at all, minimal gear, which is work pants or jeans, minimal badges, which is castle badge, no dodging or counter attacking, Mario cannot attack, Luigi cannot attack, kill Mario at the start of every battle, kill Luigi at the start of every battle, no jumping solo, no hammering solo, no hand power solo, win every battle within five turns, and only forced fights. Those are the possible rules that we can get, and I, I think you can kind of pick out some of the ones that we you didn't You didn't get. say minimal, you said minimal. Whatever. I was trying to speak as quickly as I could because I'm tired of dragging this on already. So I'm, I'm doing a little thing here, I'm, I'm, I'm shuffling them up, and I'm going to click. We got five rules to grab. Money, money! So the rules that we're working with, actually, I need to like get a piece of paper out so that I can remember this. Alright. Not that it'll really matter. Number one! No... Jumping. Alright, so already the challenge is impossible. I will see you all later. No, not really. <laughs> <laughs> of course, if it's impossible, we have to respin. So, let's respin. Oh, is that impossible? I don't, I don't, yeah. The only way you can beat the tutorial fight here is jumping. Oh. Our first one is no. Oh, thank God. <laughs> no advanced, advanced bros. bros attack. Attacks. So, we are allowed to at least use bros attacks. That's. That's good. Alright, so that's our first rule. I'm getting a piece of paper out so I can write this down. Alright, for our second one. We have... I'm gonna go ahead and let the battle theme start playing. Please don't. No Splash Bros or b b Bounce Bros. Alright, so just no Bros attacks if, if it was gonna be Kill Luigi at the beginning of the battle, I was just gonna walk out. It's going to be a little difficult to kill Luigi at the beginning. <laughs> what I, started did you I started writing knockback bros instead of bounce bros. If it, it... Okay, so kill Luigi or kill Mario at the start of every battle. That one would be a little difficult to do early <laughs> game. <laughs> that one would be a little difficult to do early game because we have to like... Purposefully mess up. You know, yeah. So, I feel Four. like that's not going to be too big of an issue. We can probably just re-roll for that. Um, unless unless y'all don't Four want to. For our third one, we uh, have... I don't think that... Oh. Alright, no, no hammer. hammer. That doesn't matter, though. So, thank <laughs> God. <laughs> Alright, so no hammering. What's this? Are going to be a fourth? Yeah. Oh. Four number... Time... Every time we go to, like, spin the wheel for the first of five rules, we reshuffle them. For number four, we have BP only. Alright. <laughs> Guess we're only upgrading BP, then. You have a loud voice. Yes, I do. I'm struggling to keep up with you. Good! <laughs> <laughs> for our last one, this roll. We, we already got that one, so I'm re we're, um, we're re-rolling. Mm -hmm. Alright. For our last one, roll, this roll, we have defense on oh. that clashes, so we're re-rolling. <laughs> it's going great. For our final roll this round, we have that clashes. Oh my god. <laughs> I think I might need to go ahead and press the shuffle button. For our final roll this round. We have 
Really? Oh my god, oh, freaking god. kill me. Already. Okay, no BP items. Okay. That's not an issue since we no can't use No BP bro's. items. We can't use bro's attack, so that's not an issue. Got it. Tutorials, by the way, are obviously exceptions to these rules. So, um... Stats only. <laughs> defense only. BP only. Attack right. only. Health so these, only. These are the rules we're playing with. Alright. Alright, so I'm controlling Mario. Brandon's controlling Luigi. The way this works is we've Clear, binded... Because I'm clearly the skinnier one. We've binded... And more stupid one. We've binded our controls to work in such a way that, um... Oh, okay. It's a tutorial! <laughs> Oh, that's fine. You haven't seen what I... Well, no, you've seen what I've done in Partners in Time Nerve Mode. I don't think everyone else has, though, unless I've already started posting the... Oh! Oh, shoot. Wait, I'm pressing buttons. What are you owing? Oh, wait. Hold on. <laughs> so, basically, what just happened was... He uh, I think, I think jumped think on hear Bowser, it. he got hit by Bowser's flame, this, he jumped on Bowser again, so far. and I think we might then need to reset. flamed Bowser. Alright. Mario! No, stop. I forgot something! Please, Brandon. I don't feel like putting it- Alright, but we've- The way this co-op is working is, we've found our controls- Please stop. Okay. We binded our control so that I am using the A button for all, well, for three of the four interface buttons. I've got X binded as B just in case I need to press that button, which I will. And I um, have Y binded as A. Yeah. And basically, when Mario is in front, I am the one who will be moving us around, and when Luigi's in the front, Brandon will be moving us around, which is why I need to have a B button, because when Mario's in back, he's got B. A button. So basically, no bros attacks, useless rule, BP only. <laughs> you can't use any bros attacks, but you can only upgrade BP. So basically, we're upgrading a useless stat right now. Like, oh, wait, yeah, more, hold more, on, I just realized that. More useless than stash. Wait, is there not any other than splash and ba- No, there's... Yes, there are There's other... knockback bros, which is pretty good. Y yes, but right now, we can't use any bros attacks because before Toastar, the only ones that we get are um, Splash and Bounce. <laughs> so basically, no bros attacks. We should really be talking, you know? <laughs> who needs commentary? Um, the right? viewers, that's who, because we want the series to be interesting. Isn't that right, viewers? Uh, Mario, what did you just do? <laughs> he, like, zipped around Luigi midair. <laughs> Quit playing Wordscapes. No. Yeah. Ram. Keep playing Wordscapes over here. Rarm. Yar. Hold on, I'm gonna Man. do a thing real quick. Airy. Yar. Ah. There we go. What I, happened? I was just doing a thing. Just scrolling down to make sure that the uh, there was a good balance. I'm gonna turn the game volume up actually. No, no. Alright, but yeah, this, um, we, we really should start thinking of some names for this challenge. Because, like, if we can't do Wheel of Misfortune, then I don't know what we can do. <laughs> I, I was guessing, like, maybe Randomize Strike Down? Challenge Strike Down? Something like that? I don't know. Or maybe we could just call it something simple. The Randomized Superstar Saga Challenge. I don't know. But then that would imply that we're using a randomizer, which, uh, isn't entirely true. I mean... It could be. Hmm, could it though? <laughs> no, no, it really couldn't. I mean, we're randomizing challenge rules, not the game itself though, so that's why I was thinking maybe we shouldn't do a name like that. Then again, what else can we really call it? Because I don't want to do like 
Oh, Wheel of Whimsy or something, because then I feel like I'm copying other YouTubers. Namely, the guy who, uh... I took major inspiration from for nerve mode. What? Not face. Quit reading comics. We got games to play. Specifically, the game that is not my favorite in the Mario Luigi series, but I play the most. And it's clearly the one you've played the most, too, considering it's the only one you've played to its full. Yeah. <laughs> Pretty much. I wish we could do this with the other games, but the problem is I don't want to use emulators and, like, try to figure out how to get it to work with Bowser's Inside Story through the Bowser's Inside Story remake. And we can't exactly do it with Partners in Time unless, again, emulators. Because... You know, playing DS games on the Wii U, you can only use the gamepad. Which sucks. Sucks a lot. I suck. I suck a lot. <laughs> <laughs> you, you think you're funny. Oh, uh, shoot. Um. You press the A button to jump, Brandon. Well, you do. I don't. Well, I do, actually, but... You get what I'm saying. No, I was trying to figure out the, um... Oh, combos for the pictures. I don't really care if I'm being honest. I think I remember which one is Mario's little battle ready pose. I just hope I don't accidentally spam it in a way such that, you know, he ends up catching the in between poses. That would not be great. At all. Wait, why is he so small? Why is he in the suitcase? <laughs> I think probably a better question is, if you've played Mario Luigi Partners in Time, you know there's a, a similar tutorial where Stuffwell goes inside of himself. I'm I don't sorry. Know how it works. Yeah, Stuffwell teaches you how to use Stuffwell by going inside of Stuffwell and pointing you around. Oh no, that's- oh, there we go. Come on, please. No, stop, 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 stop! There, thank god. Oh yeah, and only the person in front is allowed to press the start button to switch positions. That's what I'm doing. Oh, you're doing that? Don't get caught in between poses. <laughs> that would be awful. <laughs> I think... I don't know if I did or not. Well. Nope, you didn't. Okay. I, I remember during our... Oh, wait. That's right. I don't have a B button. I think during our actual, like, just generic co-op run... Hold on. Wait, wait, wait. Uh, go to the menu thing. During our generic co-op run, I think you did actually get caught between poses, which was pretty funny. Oh, the, the, nice sprite layering, by the way. Alright, um... Whoops. Oh, wait, no, yeah, that's... Watch his eyebrows. Oh, I think anyone that's played this game knows that Luigi does that. Brandon. No. Well, now they do. Thanks to me. Okay. I'm so useful. I'm gonna go ahead and accept this tutorial, simply because if I don't, then the next time I fight an enemy, he's gonna be there anyways. So it's better to just get the experience and have the tutorial happen now than later. <laughs> Brandon. You should rapid tap... What is it? Why? So that we can make this go faster. I'm now rapid pressing two buttons at once while you're all. Oh, well, I'm thanks, sorry. Brandon. I know. Thank you. I thought we were still going. I, I did more damage than you. I will say this whole co-op thing it's really does screw with my mind because I'm used to controlling both bros, not just one. Also, Luigi's shadow is partially overlaying the rail. Hold on. <laughs> yeah, this series does that a lot. Turn. Jump. I don't know why you were jumping there. Oh yeah, I did. I got. I oh got hey, I got a level up. Time to upgrade BP. Mmm, yes, BP. BP only. P 
pee pee only. Wow, you're funny. <laughs> so original. Laugh. That's better than what I could have gotten. You've gotten if I'm being honest, I'm not gonna complain about that. This you, game's bonus roulette is absolute whack, if you ask me. You've got no PP, and you've got no PP. That's hilarious. I can't stop just staring at my computer screen and gawking at how much I love the borders that I've got going on right there. I feel like the Goombas are the dogs of the Mario world. Yeah. No, they're lower than that. <laughs> Cats. Try lower. Thanks. In case you haven't noticed, nobody treasures Goombas. Except for Mario, but that's only in paper, Mario. Not really here. Anyways, get to upgrading VP, Brandon. Oh, watch this. Okay, why? I look over at the computer and I'm seeing like... Watch this skill. Ready? That's a nice skill Pure you got there. Skill. And what's your BP at? Also 12. But so I, I got to 12 with 1. I started at a worse position than you, and we're equal now. Oh, sounds like I first, think that means I'm doing better than you are. <laughs> nah, that means I'm better than you. If you say so. It's gonna be a great series. I can't wait to edit these videos in quotations. I think most of my editing for nerve mode outside of the stupid animations was just text commentary, so it's nice to not have to constantly be doing that. Well, you might need to make a few corrections, yes, but like cut out the three different times we got clashed oh no i'm not cutting that out i might do a little bit of skipping so you can't hear the like talking in between other than the reactions but like i'm not cutting that out <laughs> and i'm gone again all right goodbye luigi it's a mario time oh don't get on that phone you know you're about to be in the next battle i am yes oh right get to mashing boy I wonder if they can actually hear the sound of us mashing. That would be pretty funny. I mean, mine is silent, pretty much. <laughs> and yours, I'm very certain, is just vibrating with the gamepad. <sighs> God, right. Yeah. That's my impression of Fawful's laugh. <laughs> no, that's Kekletta. Almost. <laughs> Please stop. Scooby doo 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 I, I would do my actual Fawful laugh impression, but um, it's a bit loud and I'd like to not ruin my microphone. Not that I'm saying, oh, it's not durable or anything, it's just I don't want to take any risks. You should do it. I don't want to ruin anyone's do ears it. either. Do it. No. Have no. Your way. Oh, it would have been oh, funny if you were about to get attacked there. That would have been great. I would have loved that. And goodbye, headgear. No? And it's gotta be this headgear. turn, right? No? No. Okay, it's gonna be next turn then. I'm not keeping track of how much damage we're doing. And goodbye, headgear. No. Oh, yeah, you're right. Okay. <laughs> and goodbye, head. <laughs> Now is right when I ram you. He's break too, but Fawful definitely does not sound like Yoda. <laughs> not that that was a very good Yoda impression, because it really wasn't. Oh. <laughs> so, we gonna do the voices or? No, I told you we're skipping all the text. I don't really have time to just sit there and read all of it, you know? You know, we gotta get through this challenge, you know? No, I don't. Uh-oh. That's, that's very unfortunate. 